Hello, I'd like to take a few minutes with you today to talk about how we see the new digital business reality. We're all familiar with the mega trends that are impacting digital transformation today, and they're impacting every single business on the planet, be it looking at the unprecedented level of technology evolution, driving new levels of entrepreneurship, changing the very way in which the fabric of the economy in which we do business operates, and the way in which we have to interact and put the customer at the center of our business. That transformation is driving change in every single industry and for the industry that's underpinned so much of this digital transformation, the communications industry has to transform as well. Now is the time for us to seize the opportunity that has been presented to us as an industry and to grow very rapidly into the new digital economy. If we look at the transformation of the communications industry, first of all, we're on a very clear path to becoming more than just a communications service provider industry and to being a true digital service provider industry, providing a whole suite of digital infrastructure capabilities. But the margins on those services are thinning and we have to recognize that in order to deliver them and to deliver them at the pace our customers want, we have to automate large amounts of our business and find ways to progressively improve the margins on those services and the adaptability of those services to meet the needs of our customers today. They have to deliver the kind of customer experience that our customers expect in this digital world. And today, we've got a lot of transformation to do as an industry to move at the pace of the newly found internet industries. But we've also got an opportunity to grow our industry significantly as well, beyond just being that digital infrastructure provider. We can be the provider and the enabler of so many other services as a digital service enabler. That requires us to embrace new platform-based business models and to understand our role as being one of an enabler of ecosystems, not the ecosystem itself. Both of those journeys are taking us on the uh, direction to take us as a 2020 CSP, really a company that can both provide the underlying infrastructure and a rich set of capabilities that meet our customers' expectations and power many of the ecosystems we look at today. Simply put, we're taking our businesses on the journey from being a traditional uh, business of the 20th century to a 21st century software-defined business that's underpinned and has IT rich at the very core of how that business operates. If we think about the kinds of opportunities we're uncovering, they're boundless. We can see so many different industries, such as smart health, such as uh, smart cities, and many, many others, that are ripe for us to transform and to provide uh, capabilities into that can really shift the way in which those industries work, the economics of them, and enable us to cope with so many of the socio-economic challenges we see ahead of us today. And the communications industry plays a crucial role in enabling this, but we want that to be beyond just providing raw infrastructure and connectivity. It has to be into providing the core enabling services that underpin so many of those. For us to really embrace that, we have to embrace what are known as platform business models. Business models where we understand that we are enabling uh, commerce and business for others, and we're playing a core role within an ecosystem, but we're playing an even more essential role for the industries that we're serving as partners to them, not just providers. Now, the industry today is very focused on a lot of the opportunities in this space which are attached to 5G and 5G will be a groundbreaking technology for us but so much of the focus of the industry today is on how we technologically uh, innovate and how we provide those services. A lot of focus on things like spectrum and regulation and the underlying technology, all important topics but they miss the fact that in order to really seize the business opportunities of 5G we have to really embrace all of the different challenges and technologies uh, which are going to transform our business itself. So we have to actually transform our businesses in order to seize those opportunities. Just delivering on the technology as we've done traditionally will mean that we miss many of the true growth opportunities that 5G represents. So to help with this transformation, and it's a complex journey for our, our companies, we have to also look at what's needed in terms of the holistic transformation of our business. And to date, there's no shortage of focus in the industry on the technology and many of the security challenges that are out there attached with realizing several of those 5G opportunities. But there's so much more that needs to transform. If we think about just the structure of our organizations and the culture and the people who work for us, we've got to embrace people who can really change the game in our businesses. Think about the structure and how we really organize our teams 
and the culture that we're generating in those businesses to be much more creative, much more principle driven than we've seen in the past. We've also got to think about how we automate our operations dramatically, looking at radically different ways of automating operations through new age OSS BSS systems as we've known them traditionally and the automation of operations overall. We have to think about how we change the approach and the position of the customer in our business to use tools like design thinking to put the customer at the centre of our creative process and then to really use deep analytics to understand that customer through the life cycle and continuously better engage them and provide services they want dynamically and at the time they want. And all of that leads us to a business that's continuously innovating, one that embraces open innovation and embraces a level of agility in the whole business, the ability of the business to respond at the speed of the market, and that allows us to drive truly adaptive digital businesses. TM Forum, to help guide our members on this very complex journey, is producing a new digital business maturity model that will help to both connect companies into an understanding of as a business where they are in this complex journey and help them to map out the next steps, but also to benchmark themselves against others in the industry and to reach into TM Forum's deep asset library to help us to connect you with the tools that can help you to drive that transformation.